Hey YouTube. This is a video on how to text on your iPod Touch. To do this, you gotta have Wi Fi. You gotta have the AIM app and an AIM account to do this. <clears throat> but if you got that, then you're good to go. Go to it. Go to IM. Click this little box up here. It says two screen name or SMS. I'm gonna text my girlfriend because I'm recording this on my phone. So, but you gotta put the area code thing in. So, like I gotta put in one eight one. Oh shit! One two one eight one two. That's the area code thing. Zip code, whatever you wanna call it. Four four seven. Alright, I got a number in, and you just go down to this little bubble box thing, type it in, I'll put text back. Again. And send. I don't know if it's gonna. It didn't. I don't think it sent because it didn't do that. Didn't do the noise like it usually does. It's already send it. Oh, she did text back, see? Can't really read that, really, but... Shows her number. She said, okay, can you forward that pic of Jeff to me? Let me want to see it. And I'll say... Okay. Sent. And we'll see if... She texts back again. She probably won't, though. But, uh, I know for sure that this is free for you because there's no way to bill on an iPod Touch. But, really, I don't think it's free for the person that you're texting to. I think it charges as you're on the internet. But, I don't she texted back. So do you want me to keep talking to you on this? I'm going to say no. But, yeah. I don't think it's free for them, but it's free for you. So, I mean, if it's an emergency, go for it. Or if you don't even have a cell phone, I mean, go ahead and text your friends. I mean, if they want to text you back and pay the bill, then I guess they'll do it. I mean, it's not, it's not bad for you. It might be bad for them, but... Really, I don't know, but there you go. Try to text on the iPod Touch.